when people think about unity in a, in a body of believers or a ministry group, they often uh, confuse unity with uniformity. Uniformity is when people all think alike on a certain topic, or maybe a lot of topics. Sometimes in a church setting, maybe the smaller the church, the easier this is, people think alike on politics and style issues and how loud the music should be and what music we should sing, and people think alike. But if a ministry grows at all, or your group of leaders or your group of mission leaders grows at all, very quickly you will have people thinking differently. And the kind of unity that we're called to in the scripture is not based on uniformity. Uh, it's based on hanging on to the things that are most important and a commitment one to another to say, we may disagree on these other secondary issues, but we are together uh, on these core issues. The Bible calls us to strive for unity, to maintain the, the unity of the Spirit and the bond of peace. This is not easy. And I, as a church leader, especially during these years of COVID, um, I have had to work very hard with our congregation on this, including addressing these issues very, very directly. But, but conformity means we're all alike. And I think people pr would prefer that. It'd be nice to go into a little bubble where everyone thinks just like I do. Uh, but I'm, I say to people often, that would be a very small group. Maybe you and one other person, and maybe just you. Unity, rather, is a commitment to the same core causes that says, I love you as a brother or sister in Christ. Because of that, that we have freedom to not think alike on every issue.